Okay, you know if you've been following my channel recently, I've been showing fake pictures of Earth from faith that uh, so many people, ball earthers, anti-flat earth channels, when they show a picture of the Earth, shows repeating clouds. It's just fakery. So all the ball earthers would say, oh, well, of course, everybody knows those are fake. Those aren't real. They're just images. Then all these satellites for... 70 years we've been in space. You, you're telling me they haven't just taken pictures? We don't have pictures galore? Put up a real picture. You don't understand, people. The Earth is very shy. You can't just take a picture of it. It's always putting its hands in its face, people. So I went right to the NASA website. Okay, so this picture or this image was produced in 2015. Is it real or fake? All right, let's see what it says about it. Let's read the caption. A NASA camera on the Deep Space Climate Observatory satellite has returned its first view of the entire sunlit side of Earth from one million miles away. Okay, this color image of Earth was taken by NASA polychromatic imaging camera, a four megapixel CCD camera and telescope. The image was generated by combining three separate images to create a polygraphic quality image. The camera takes a series of 10 images, 10 images, using different narrow band filters from ultraviolet to near infrared to produce a variety of scientific product. Scientific products? Why can't you just snap, take a camera and just snap a picture and show us? the earth what do you mean you got to make it with all these images the red green and blue channel images are used in these color images the image was taken july 6 2015 showing north and central america the central turquoise areas are shallow seas around the caribbean islands this earth image shows the effects of sunlight scattered by air molecules, giving the image a characteristic bluish tint. The EPIC team is working to remove this atmospheric effect from subsequent images. Once the instrument begins regular data acquisition, EPIC will provide a daily series of Earth images allowing for the first time study of daily variations over the entire globe. These images, available 12 to 36 hours after they are acquired, will be posted to a dedicated web page by September 2015. The primary objective of DISCOVER, a partnership between NASA and the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, and the U.S. Air Force, is to maintain the nation's real-time solar and wind monitoring capabilities. All fake. There is no solar wind and which are critical to the accuracy and lead time of space weather alerts. Today will be sunny and solar windy alerts and forecasts from NOAA. For more information about Discover, visit blah, blah, blah. All right. So is this real? Ball earthers? Is this real or fake? It's on your NASA site. It should be real, right? Okay. Let me know in the comments. And I'll do a follow-up. I'm going to get back to my uh, rotation videos again because I've got a crusher, <laughs> an absolute crusher coming up. All right. Thanks, everybody. And let me know. And I will do a follow-up on this. Let me know if it's real or fake. Okay. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.